What's up guys, it's Brian again from Lake Kicker Scuba Marina. Got another quick gear review for you. Today we're gonna look at a regulator system from the Mares XR line, and this is their 25X DR regulator system or deep reg regulator system. Now the first thing that you're gonna notice, it does come in its own little bag here that you can use, not after you purchase of course, but you can use it as your regulator bag as well. Now it does come with foam padding. I would suggest once you've assembled your reg or had a, your local dealer assemble the reg, get rid of the foam padding because it does kinda um, get in the way when you're trying to store your reg once it's put together. So let's go ahead and open it up here and see everything that comes in the bag. Now, the first thing that you're going to notice, there is going to be several different hoses in here. We're going to temporarily set these aside and come back to these just briefly. You are going to have several pieces of foam in here that really protects the regs during shipping or anything like that. I'm just going to set those aside. And you'll notice that it does come with two second stages and two first stages. Now, this reg system is really designed for back mounted doubles or even a side mount situation where you're running tanks underneath your arms. Now, with the regs itself, you're going to get two of the 25X first stages. These are a balanced first stage or a very high performing diaphragm first stage. And they're also environmentally sealed so it's going to work very good for cold water or any type of environment that you don't want a lot of water getting into the reg this is actually going to protect any water from actually coming into the reg itself now it does only come in den so you got do have to have a den uh, valve on your cylinders but most people who's going to be in back mounted doubles or side mount will be diving den now each 25X is going to have three ports here on the side. On the back side, there's no port, so it's really designed for that back mounted system or side mounted systems. You're gonna have one high pressure port and two low pressure ports on each of the first stages. You're gonna have two that are identical. And these first stages have quite a bit of weight to them, so they're really gonna be able to withstand a beating that most divers put their gear through. Now, taking a quick look at the second stages themselves, the first thing you'll notice, they look very similar in design to the Abyss second stage, and it really was modeled after the Abyss, so that's one reason it's got the similar look. It is a metal housing second stage, so it's gonna work really well in cold water. It's gonna have a lot of thermal capacity, so it's gonna help keep that second stage from freezing up. It's got a very large purge button here on the front, so if you're diving in that colder water environment, you got thick gloves or dry suit gloves, then it's gonna be very easy to purge your regulator in the event you need to. It does have their standard air bypass tube, or what they call the VAD, the Vortex Assisted Delivery. And all that does is, is as your air comes into the second stage, it's gonna divert that airflow straight into the mouthpiece itself, and it creates a vortex here in the second stage, which makes it easier to inhale per breath. You are going to have a vented exhaust port down here that's going to help deflect the bubbles or from your expired gas out and away from you. So if you're trying to take pictures and you got your camera mounted to your mask or something like that, it's going to prevent those bubbles from coming up in your face. Just a standard rubber mouthpiece here that is very easy to uh, take off and put on a new one if you want to. And it does have several vents here in the first stage that's going to get rid of some of the drag if you're diving in a current or anything like that. But that's the DR second stage of the 25X DR system. Now setting this aside, we're gonna take a quick look at the other accessories that come with it. You are gonna get a regulator necklace for your alternate. You're also gonna get two hoses here. And the first hose is a very short hose. This is designed for your alternate in a back mount situation. If you're gonna be diving these regs in a, a side mount, I would suggest getting rid of this and going with a, either a standard length reg hose or a 36 inch reg hose for your left cylinder, if that's the way you configure yours. But in a back mounted system, this is a very short hose and it makes it very easy to hang your alternate underneath your neck. You're also going to get a standard seven foot or seven foot hose here. It does come with a bolt snap. Now you'll have to um, get you some cave line to tie on your bolt snap yourself. It doesn't come with that, but it does come with a, a small little bolt snap here. And it's just a, a seven foot hose or a long hose, if you will, if you're diving in overhead environments, back mounted um, doubles or in that side mount situation. So guys, that is the 25X DR reg system from the Mares XR line. Like I said, it does come in its own little case, so you can use the case after the fact as your regulator system 
once you have everything assembled. If you got any questions on how to assemble it, take it to your local Mares dealer. They'll be happy to set it up for you. Guys, I really appreciate you watching this video. If you got any questions on this, simply put it down in the comment section below. If you dive the XR line for Mares, smash that like button, or if you're interested in it, smash the like button for me. As always, guys, make sure you check back each week for new videos. Make sure you follow us on Instagram and Twitter. Like us on Facebook. Pin us on Pinterest. Subscribe to us here on YouTube. And as always, guys, we appreciate your business.